Good afternoon. The FBI announced today a $20,000 reward for information that helps solve the disappearance of Tara Calico. There have been a number of rewards over the years, countless leads and tips, but still no answers. Now, after 31 years, the FBI says it is time to bring this to an end. We will not give up. We can't give up. We have no doubt. Somebody out there knows what happened to Tara. We want that person or somebody who knows that person to come forward and call us. Let us bring Tara home. Tara was just 19 years old when she disappeared on September 20th, 1988, while riding her mom's pink bicycle on Highway 47 south of Rio Communities. The tips over the last 31 years have led to multiple digs in Valencia County, to an eerie picture found in the parking lot of a convenience store in Florida, and a lot of theories. Tara's picture was even featured on a set of playing cards for unsolved crimes being distributed by the Bernalillo County Sheriff's Office with a reward attached. That reward has since expired. Still, no Tara. Over the last few years, Tara's sister Michelle and a former classmate, Melinda, have joined forces to investigate the case themselves. Working with the Valencia County Sheriff's Department and the FBI, they say they have ruffled some feathers and have learned new information. They are hopeful this reward is a new tipping point. We're very excited because to us it lets us know that they are actively working on the investigation and you know through our podcast we've been able to bring forward hundreds of leads so we think that it's great that they're offering this because who knows you know you never know when someone needs twenty thousand dollars and they're hanging on to a piece of information that they start feeling guilty about. Esquivel, Tara's sister, and many investigators have long believed those responsible for Tara's disappearance are locals, and the story of what happened remains with someone here at home. They are begging that person or persons to come forward with that information and finally put this case to rest once and for all. Now, the day Tara disappeared, she was wearing a white First National Bank of Belen t-shirt, white shorts with green stripes, white socks, and white and turquoise Avia tennis shoes. She was also wearing a gold butterfly ring with a diamond insert, a gold amethyst ring, and gold hoop earrings. If you have any information, you're asked to call the FBI.